welcome to the stream. We are working on Donkey Kong once again. Um, I'm also eating some peanut butter. It is dinner time. It tastes delicious. Get that protein and fat in my body so I can go and do things. Mmm. And of course, we're, um, we're on several different platforms today. Once again, we are on Periscope, Facebook, DLive, Daily Motion, Twitch. And I, I think we're getting really, really close into finishing Donkey Kong. And it's been a very long road uh, since we started this project. And. very long time working on this project and hey what's up we got our first set of comments hello penguin hello Sevio. welcome to the stream mm. for anybody who has not seen the donkey kong level as of now let's go let's do a little deep dive let's take a look also, in like a week, I'll have a new laptop and the stream will be a little bit more fluid than what it is. Computer, turn on plug one. Okay. Yeah, like, get a little bit more, more light going on here. I can't wait to like voice automate everything. Throw it back in the freezer. Yeah, we'll talk about it later. Yeah. The fridge is also leaking. Oh, okay. Oh, my fridge is leaking. Great. Anyway, everybody, thank you so much for stopping by. Um, man, so this is what we've been working on for the longest time now. Uh, we're remaking the first level of Donkey Kong, or the first video game of Donkey Kong, as a 360 animated film. And we have spent time animating everything. We have our logo, we have the levels, we have fire that pops up. We have camera animations for the characters. You know, everything is just amazing right now. But the last thing we need to do, and the thing I frankly have been putting off um, since we started, has been animating Donkey Kong. And so that's what we're going to be doing today. And we're going to be doing that in a couple of different ways. Uh, we're going to be doing that in a couple of different ways. And the first thing we're going to be doing is actually picking up or trying to find applicable movements on um, Mixamo. So anybody who doesn't know what Mixamo is, it's a free stock resource site um, provided by Adobe and Mixamo. And basically what's happening is they have all these preset animations that you can download, right? And so we're, that's exactly what we're going to be doing. Yep, yep. Uh, I am in a full house. You can hear people in the background. Thank you. Um, but as we like go through all the animation work, we can take a look at um, idle movements. And so I, I feel like this is, what is it? What does it just look like he's holding somebody in the air? That's not good. Now, we are looking for things that are kind of like um, what you would traditionally see 
Donkey Kong do? <clears throat> and we might be able to... You know, I think this would be a great barrel toss. Let's do six points. Let's do without skin. 30 frames a second. None. Let's download. And this will be the first animation that we're grabbing for Donkey Kong with all the skeleton movement. Yep, there is a bunch of noise in the background. There's nothing I can do about that. Sorry. Uh, so now that we have our first FBX, uh, what I can do is go ahead and grab it. And we can... I don't know, open up... Uh, let's see. Show folder. Get another one opening and hold on. I know what I'm doing, I'm a professional, I swear. Donkey Kong VR, let's do animations. And this will be, it's not a great sword slash. This is barrel throw. Now these don't have to be absolutely perfect. They just have to be close enough that it looks like they're doing. And you, we are going to be um, so occupied with going through the movements on our own journey that as long as Donkey Kong is kind of continuously moving, uh, we'll be able to, you know, he'll, he'll look like he's doing it. Why does it crouch? Why is it not jump up? We, we do, new, do need a uh, some kind of jump, though. Like a, like a, from a crouch to a jump. Okay, I feel like this might be the idle pose. So I'm gonna download this without skin, download. And this is just for him kind of going back and forth, right? So I'm gonna grab this and we'll put it into our animations. So we need something that kind of looks like Donkey Kong would be would be jumping. Zombie reaction hit, right? All right, let's see if we can get kind of a jump. What the hell?
Those are wild. <laughs> Right. Yeah, and this is the jump. Hey, thank you. Mm. Yeah, um, just in case anybody is interested, um, I've started making reels and things. Uh, so I've been taking like old pieces that I did and I have been turning them into like Instagram reels. And you can take, so you can basically create the same portrait video and you can put it into um, Instagram and Facebook and TikTok and YouTube and basically just to have it in a bunch of places. And this is literally the piece that I put up today. And they all kind of look like little NFTs. Boo, crush. So I'm not going. There we go. So I'm really excited about this direction I'm doing. Gonna do so much. I do want to check uh, how it's performing. So I put it on all three platforms and well, I think we're doing okay. It has four likes, so maybe not. <laughs> I mean, right now it's all testing for me. I mean, I'll get like at least 150 video, you know, views doing this. Okay, and let's go ahead and check. Four views. Man, these videos are not hitting. Which sucks because it takes so much time to make these. And I actually, I started scheduling them out up to like 10 days ahead. So if you guys are following the accounts, you guys can see them. All right. So anyway. Hmm. So there is a bit of a tutorial that I'm going to have to follow to be able to get everything in here. What? Uh, I'm not drinking coffee. No, no, so this used to be called Evening Coffee, um, which was the first time I, I did like a show. It was uh, like three days a week, and just like this, and then I stopped doing it for a while, and now as a way to keep me motivated and continuously you know, creating. Um, 
I started like live streaming again because it just forces me to commit to doing something. And I actually have a um, the next project on the docket is um, I need to finish gluten, um, and I'm one scene short of having that short completely animated. And the next right after that, I have an intro shot for a artificial intelligence um, animated cartoon that I'm doing. And I did it with Jeff Stilwell, who was on a couple of shows on Netflix, and my friend Chris Vance, who was in a bunch of Ford commercials, Ford truck commercials, with that guy from, like, um, Dirty Jobs. And um, actually, I got to play a character. Uh, I got to play Aaron, the necromancer, or sorcerer, whatever he is. And Topher actually is the the voice in the narration. I'm really excited for it. Also, it'll be a really interesting cartoon because I've never used. Um, well, it's not. Te it's technically not AI, but it's using some sort of like computer vision to be able to figure out where lines are, and then animate accordingly onto. on the characters. And then I think we have to do like flapping mouths for the whole thing, which is kind of funny. Actually, it's going to be really funny because the mouths are just so weirdly disconnected. So, now that we have these, I'm going to have to follow this tutorial just a little bit. I still have the chat up if you guys, you know, are, are talking to me. Yeah, I have, I have two different drinks that I'm currently cutting between. Yeah, I started in... So, I, the stream is supposed to start at 6 o'clock. Um, but my... My roommate and I have this like weekly meeting on Mondays, and it got shifted from Monday to Wednesday because he was some stuff was going on with him, and then he didn't show up, and there was some miscommunication. So I thought, okay, you know, we're we're doing at seven thirty, and. Then he got home and he's like, I need to mow the lawn really quick. So he, he ran off to mow the lawn and, and I couldn't start until he was done with that. So normally we would start at six, um, but just one thing after another uh, pushed it back. That's why. That is why. So, I'm gonna have to back up a little bit into this tutorial.
All right, I just want to make sure that the animations are... Okay, so we have the barrel throw. We have the... No, stop. Get out of here. This is idle, right? And, okay, let's find our download area. And this is the jump up. Okay. And with that, that is all three animations we need. Right. Yeah, animation is really slow, guys. It, it does take a very long time to do animation. And that's okay. I mean, with 3D, we're able to, you know, create tools that allow us to ha move the process along a little bit faster than traditionally. But back in the day, it was 100% paper and pens and pencils. And, um, I mean, there's a, there's a documentary about Pixar um, that I think, I can't remember what it is off the top of my head, but... Um, it basically tells the entire story of like how Pixar became the B, how Steve Jobs got involved, um, what their first, when they were planning to do the very first like animated film ever, other uh, thing that would become Toy Story, they brought in what's called the seven old men. And these seven men are like the best hand animators to ever live and they were all working at Disney and it was this weird moment of old people teaching the newer generation who were transferring pen and paper into 3D and I don't think the significance was lost on them it just it just seemed like a proper passing of the torch and since then, um, animation tools have become easier to use, and we're getting things that, you know, pretty soon we'll just have to act things out completely and with a camera pointing at us, and suddenly we'll be, you know, completely animated, and that would be really cool. So let's take a look. Let's follow this tutorial. Alright, so this is the base for everything. And Donkey Kong, cool. Do, do, do. Okay. 
Okay, so from here, I believe there's a timeline, right? Okay, so basically what we've done is we have hooked up the skeleton to a motion system. And now we can start adding other animations in. Um, and from there, we can basically move the animations on a timeline and it'll mix and match the different animations to create um, larger animation movements over through the entire movie. Okay, so if I hit this, um, I can open the timeline, perfect. And this is our initial Donkey Kong movement. It's a static pose. And so let's... So there's other animations we're gonna be able to... So file, merge objects, and we'll do the barrel throw. Okay. And, oh, what is it? oh yeah, I need to, um, is it add new layer or child of, Man, sorry, my foot just got super freaking itchy all of a sudden. You guys doing well? You guys hanging out with me while we're doing this? Right. I do realize, yes, I started much later than I originally would have. And that's okay. Hey. Give me a small. Oh, gotcha. Uh, check the tub that I have in the other bathroom. Say hi to the stream. Hi, stream. Hi, stream. You stream. We all stream for nice stream. Sounds like we're all getting ice cream. Right. Man. So sorry. My foot got itchy. My foot got so itchy. <clears throat> okay. So, um, we need to, I believe, we gotta get a, we gotta get a new, no. Do we need to, wait, how is he grouping it? This, this is a new system I'm learning, so. That's interesting. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of this. 
All right, so file merge objects, barrel throw, standard settings. It didn't, it didn't ask if it wanted to do retakes. It's interesting. Uh, let's see if we can just add it as a motion clip. Animate and motion clip. And so, if we are hmm. Think something. Gonna hide it. Okay, so, wait, wait, did it move them all the way back at zero? All right, that's really interesting. <laughs> uh what you know let's let's try to add the other ones in here I'm gonna delete this um let's go ahead and let's merge idle pose And we'll go ahead and add jumping up. Okay. Wait, are these just the hips? Idle pose. Uh, anime 
animation, animate, and motion clip. Man, Bitcoin is down right now. Might be a good time to buy more. Might be a good time to buy more. Good time to buy more. You know, I may have to redo Donkey Kong, unfortunately. I think he may need to be in a T-pose. Oh, what? <laughs> Like, 
I'm not I'm not even sure what he's what he's doing. with his eyes. Man. I spent $15 on this. Why are your eyes working? You know, I may have to do just a whole study on merging animation sequences by myself. Man, this has been a super weird stream. And super much, much shorter than I thought it was going to be. All right.